Okay, here I am everybody. I'm back. Oh my god. Right. First things first, sorry about um the witch's house, but my computer blew up just as I was about to edit the second episode and I lost all of the footage and I don't want to go through it again because we'll know where all the jump scares were are, even though it's been a while. But you know, I just put them in I might go back to it, you know, I don't know. But that was that would that would have been amazing. I'm so sorry. <laughs> Stupid laptops. Um, secondly, about Eve, I will eventually get the other two new endings and all that, and post them. Nah. But anyway, oh my gosh, here we are back again with games of awesomeness. And this is so pretty. Oh my god, look at it. It's called Alice Mare. If you can't read. Don't know how you operated YouTube. Maybe someone did it for you. I don't. Anyway, <laughs> so yeah, uh, we're back and we've got a lovely game. And it's called Alice Mare, and I I'm in love with Alice in Wonderland. So let's do this! Oh my god, I'm so excited. The ant told me that the frog is bad, but I like frogs. The frog told me that the cat is bad. I like frogs. <laughs> the cat told me no. The rabbit is the worst of them all. God damn it, white rabbit. <laughs> So I killed them all. Maybe I have a mouse. Am I supposed to have one? <laughs> oh, look at the little fingers! They're so cute. They look like um, Charlie's work. Charlie, if you're watching, hi. I love your drawings. Anyway, um, <laughs> so so that's roughly how life will be for you here. If you don't understand, there's a note in your room that explains it all again. No one will ask anything of you here. There are a few things to keep to. But it should be a peaceful life. In addition, here. We have a notebook! I love notebooks. <laughs> Your own personal notebook. I use it however as you however you like, for sad or happy times. Just write down any feelings any feeling you have and give it to me, would you? Haha. <laughs> so, but some children need to doodle in it. That's fine by me too. Now there's still some time before dinner. You should greet the other children. Leave and go straight straight left, and you'll find your rooms. They're all good children. It may not be immediate per se, but you'll get along, I'm sure. Ah, and myself? Just call me teacher. And I look forward to having you here, Alan. Okay, what I know about this is about an orphan, I think, called Alan. Yeah, so I guess- Oh, look at Prince, so cute! <laughs> it's like when you first play on Altonia about- I mean, fuck. Um, I mean, that- Thing, uh, <laughs> that homestuck thing. Basically, when you first play the little games, the trolls, when you're in the, the computer room and you basically spend the first five minutes running around like a twat, just going, Run, I got it! <laughs> and I think it actually points that out when you play as John, but I never played as John. Do you. Okay, I guess we can't look at shit. Oh, we can. A variety of books. How delightful. Can we talk? It seems you haven't greeted the others. Come back once you're done. I don't mind if I take a look around the other room. What is this piece of paper? Basic controls, okay. That is... Be careful, there is no confirmation for resetting. I'm leaving! Oh! <laughs> you have to present it. Right. What is this? Dining room. Well, warm. Aww. Warm. It is warm. <laughs> a strange design. Holy shit! It's a painting for me. We're all gonna die. Fuck. If I if I keep forgetting to press space every time we go to a door, we're screwed. I'm sorry, guys. When it comes to when something's chasing me, we're just gonna die straight away. Do you have to press bit? No, we don't. Okay. Vibrio. Biblioteca. Lots of story books. Lots of difficult books. Book on illness? Aww. They sure have a lot of exactly the same type of book. <laughs> Can I take this candle? I want a candle. Candles are cool. Nope, but you sure can point it out. A candle! Oh my god! There is no one here for me to introduce myself. What is on the floor? 
strange floor pattern? I don't understand. What is with the boxes? Can I? No. Okay. Mess the ball kind of things. Mess. Is it gonna start getting? Ah. Uh, oh, I hate those. Butterfly specimens. Oh. Okay. Well, there is literally no one here. I think this teacher guy is a little bit crazy. You know, imagining people's. Oh, maybe there is. Nope. Visual guys, teacher's not doing too well. Oh, <laughs> found one. <laughs> oh, she has red eyes. That's pretty. Hey, look at Zeb. Oh, that's odd. You can speak. Probably because you don't really feel like you're alive. Ellen, uh, Alan, is it? I'm Stella. Sorry, we did it for you. What do you want from me, mice? Question mark. Yes, I hate living people, but the people here don't really feel that way. Among them all, you feel the least alive. Hmm. Maybe not quite right. Something about you is different. Hey, that's a compliment, alright. Uh, okay, so she doesn't like living people. That's cool. Do's and don'ts. Avoid leaving your room as much as possible, etc. Uh, free time, body breaks, okay. <laughs> don't take things from my room, don't break anything if you do, tell teacher. Don't force your way into locked rooms, don't hit other people. Tell teacher about anything that troubles you or that you want. Why do you have a zebra in your drawing? Um, you're just gonna say the exact same thing to me, huh, ghost girl? The clock says three, has every other generic clock in the world? Who is. Who is this? Joshua. Are we gonna see all these noobs in Wonderland? <gasps> Look at he's so cute! So My name's Brown. Your name's Josh. Oh wait, was it Marcus? Might have been Nicole. Alan, huh? Or maybe it was Helen. Oh well, nice to meet you. He's forgotten his name. That's nice. So, what is your name, dumbass? There are a lot of frogs out in the garden here. Spiders and slugs too. Peach doesn't pay much attention, so I quietly put them in his shoulder and stuff. <laughs> I like you, kid. Chelsea has teddy bears that are gonna come alive and eat us. Oh, she's so cute. But, um, I'm Chelsea. Nice to meet you. What? Oh, it's nothing. It's nothing. <laughs> oh my god. I like how the characters actually move this time. You know the ones you don't talk to. Okay. Letty and Rick. They share a room, are they twins? Same wow, I've never seen you before. Oh, she's so cute! I've never seen you before. Oh, you're the one teacher mentioned. Call me Letty. There's also Rick, but he's not here right now. He's a very nice boy. And you're Ellen. That'd be very nice if we could play. Nice to know. Woohoo! I like how the beds are right next to each other. They might as well be hitting the double bed. I look at Daya. Filled with your clothes. What? Not that I'm gonna go see this one. Can I go this one? <laughs> oh, it's the bathroom. <laughs> okay, that's enough of that now. I think we have seen everybody. So. Wish I'd go that phone keeps scaring me. It's a motion phone. Wait, it wasn't up here, was it? Fuck me. What's down here? What is this? I, did, I guess it's just the exit. <laughs> there is teacher's room, right? Yes, hello, teacher. You have to text yourself. How did it go? Um, no. You're just in time for dinner. Let's go to the dining room. Sorry for any like crunching noises. I'm making joke. <laughs> I got way too much help for Christmas. I'm not complaining though. <laughs> Exhorted me, oh teacher! Why do I sing though? I was meant to feel like a. Never mind. Alright, return to your rooms and let's get ready to go to bed. You can go to each other's rooms to talk, but don't go on the second floor. Dismiss! You haven't been here for long, but it seems you're used to things already. How are your memories doing? I see. Well, no, don't push yourself to remember. Just take it nice and slow. I'm sure you remember everything.